Hey everyone, I'm just gonna go ahead and tell you all this stuff that I'm having in this video. My hair in this video is a little bit spiraled out just right here. And then it's just pinned up in the back, halfway up, halfway down, and it looks really ridiculous in this camera. In real life, it looks really cute actually, but in this camera, it looks really dumb. These earrings I'm wearing, they are just these little strings. And they have a little pearl at the end. On my lips, I'm wearing Maybelline's Born With It. It is a pink lip color like this. And it's kind of shimmery, it's not matte, but I like it. And then I'm just wearing L'Oreal Infallible Plum Pink. Like I always wear, I have a green look in this um, video. That's really all it is. If you want to see a tutorial on it, whoa, comment below and I will do that. I'm wearing this little shirt. It has these little penguins or swans on them. And it has some glittery stuff on it and I love it so much. And then I'm wearing this bracelet. My nails, look at them, they're so crazy. This is not painted. This has a thousand different colors. Why? Because I recently got four new makeup Blah, not makeup, I'm dumb. Nail polishes. And I got three from OPI, the ones that I ordered off of Amazon. And then I got one from Walmart, which is a Rimmel. So the one from Walmart looks like this. It's a shimmery blue. I don't know if you can really tell on camera. And it is called Marine Blue. So I got that. I got this one by OPI. It is called Strawberry Margarita. There you go. You don't even really care to see the name. Why am I showing you the name? I got Jade is the New Black, which you've probably heard of, but I've been wanting to get it forever. This is annoying. Why am I showing you? I just need to show you. I'm so shaky. And then I got Do You Lie Like It, which is this really pretty light purple. Can't really see how pretty it is in this camera. Ooh. Okay. So. I got these four, and I cannot decide what color to paint my nails. Which color do you think I should paint my nails? This is the colors. This is the Jay's New Black. It looks really gross because chipped. Do you lie like it? Chipped. Rimmel, chipped, and strawberry margarita. This was just a little bit testing on my fingernails to see how they look. So which one do you guys vote for? Pinky, ring, middle, or pointer? Comment below and let me know because I want to know what color to paint my nails. But let's get on with this video because this is already annoying and long. Alright, this video is about my exciting little upcoming news that I have to share with you guys. I graduated early from high school, so I'm young. You might think that I'm older than I am, but I'm really 17 years old. I don't know if you're going to hate me for that or love me for that, but I'm only 17. But I do go to college because I graduated early and also I started school early because of the way my birthday falls so I'm younger than everybody even if I was still in high school. Um, so I started college for nursing because nursing is in high demand and you know it's guaranteed job and money and all that. So I was like alright I'll just do that I'll be a nurse I guess that's interesting I'll care for people. But I did not really want to deal with it. I can't even look at my own blood. I just always convince myself. You know, maybe it's just my own blood I can't look at, but even when I say blood, it makes me really queasy. And I always pass out when I'm bleeding. So, I was like, I really just cannot do this. And always in the back of my mind, I had in my head, I want to go to cosmetology school. I want to go to cosmetology school because that's what I truly love. That's what I have a passion for. That's what I'm interested in. But I was just like, no, because I won't make a lot of money and I want to have a lot of money. So I posted on Facebook how I wanted to go to cosmetology school and everyone was saying, do it, do it, do something that you love. You're going to be miserable for the rest of your life if you do something that you don't even love for the money. Money isn't everything. So I was like, okay, that's cool. I might do this. But then I was like, I'm already started in this college and stuff and it's going to be a lot to switch. And then I was researching cosmetology schools and they are like $10,000 more a year than the college I was going to. So I was like, I don't know how I'm gonna afford this. I'm gonna have to switch. My parents don't even know yet. Cause I was deciding this all when my mom was out at dinner. Well, the next morning 
I go into the kitchen and my mom's like, I found some cosmetology schools. And I was like, she must have seen it on Facebook. She finds out everything on Facebook. But, um, so she found some cosmetology schools and she was going to call them up. And she said she was really supportive of what I wanted to do. And then I was like, well, what about my dad? My dad's going to be like, why are you leaving your nursing career to go to some makeup school? Because I just thought that he wouldn't really be supportive or he wouldn't think that was a good thing to do because nursing was just a stable, always in need job. So I was scared to really let him know about it. But then I talked to him on the phone and he said that he saw it on Facebook and he was like, so I see you have a career change and all this stuff. And he actually was really supportive about it. And he said that he would support anything that I wanted to do and that it's a good market to go into. And if I really like it, I should do that because nursing is a kind of depressing scene and that do what I had to do to just make it happen. So I was so happy. I was like, oh my gosh. He actually supports this. And my whole family was like supporting it and being so happy about it. So I was like, you know what? I'm just going to do it. So I dropped from my my little nursing school, which at the time I wasn't in the nursing program yet. I was just doing regular basic classes like biology and English and blah, boring stuff. And then, so I go. If you guys have heard of this college, Blue Cliff College, don't know if you have. It's in the Mississippi, Louisiana region. And I go there, get interviewed by the guy, talk to the guy, and this is a wonderful, wonderful place to me. I'm like, this is the best place ever. This is the best. And he's telling me, he's like, so you know, you go to those community colleges and you're taking all these classes, English, biology, math, science. Why did I say science and biology? But he was like, you're taking all that, and then you take that for like two years of basics, and then you start with your major. He was like, but kids these days, we don't want to do that. We want to go straight into our major. He was like, this college focuses directly on your major. He's like, you will start here, you will be hands-on, cosmetology, and we don't care when Christopher Columbus sailed around the earth. We don't care about that English essay. He was like, you care about what you're going to be doing, and what you're going to be doing for the rest of your life. You want to get you want to get it done and you want to start making money and he said it's a 12 month program and in 12 months I will be out there with a job supporting my family he was like right now mom supports you you can support mom in 12 months that's how fast this is and I was like oh my gosh this is the best ever I'm never gonna sit in another boring class I'm never gonna write an essay I'm gonna be doing something every day that I love and I'm actually so excited to go to school so I apply and I do my financial aid. Turns out I have got grants, I have got loans, it completely pays for everything. So it's all paid for. So I was like, oh my gosh, I don't even have to worry about how I'm paying for this. It's all completely paid for. They did the financial aid in an hour and a half. My last college, it took them weeks and weeks and weeks and I still never found out what I was getting. They did this in an hour and a half and I knew. It was amazing and also the reason that I like to be a nurse is because I can wear scrubs and I just love, love, love scrubs because they're so comfortable and loose and you look professional and even if you're like bloated, you don't look chubby. <laughs> but he told me, he was like, cosmetology students wear black scrubs, medical students wear blue scrubs, all that because they have massage therapy there and everything also. So I was like, oh my gosh, I'm going to get to wear black scrubs and I'm going to look so cute and feel professional and they will know I'm a cosmetology student and I get to wear black or white tennis shoes. So I was so excited and guess what? I start cosmetology school on March 7th. Actually March 9th because 7th and 8th is a holiday for them, but I start on March 9th. So I will be a cosmetology student. I will be doing something that I actually love and I'm so, so happy. I've never been excited to go to school. And I'm so excited to go to school. And it's going to be so fun. Like, I don't even feel like it's school. I just feel like it's a job where I'm paying them. And then also, they have a, they have a little salon in there that whenever you are, like, in your last five months of the training, you cut people's hair that come from the public. And it's really cheap cutting. Like, my mom wants to get her highlights done there and her hair cut and wash and shampooed. And it's only $35. That is hundreds of dollars in the salon. And the man told me that whenever I'm going there, I'm going to cut my hair and dye my hair so many times. And I'm so excited for that. I don't think I'm going to cut it a lot. But I do think that I'm going to be getting some cute highlights. And it's going to be free. And I love that. I was like, I'm going to be so beautiful going to this school. 
because it's hair cutting, dyeing, it's skin, it's makeup, it's waxing, it's facials, it's all of that, and nails. So I was like, oh my gosh, this is going to be the best school ever, and I'm going to be learning all of this stuff, and I'm going to share it with you guys on YouTube. I'm going to share all my little tips and tricks and how-tos on YouTube, so you are all going to be coming along with me to my cosmetology school because I'm going to be letting you know everything that I know. So, you can be expecting to get a lot of tips and stuff that I have learned because I'm going to be so excited to tell you all and include you in on my little experience and the best, 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 best part of this whole thing, he tells me, you are going to be getting this kit. And I think it's like a tiny little kit, you know, it is a huge box. It is a huge box, like bigger than this. I don't even know. And it's a huge box and he shows it to me. He said that it includes everything that I will ever need to cut hair, to do makeup, to do facials, to do waxing, to do nails. He said it comes with everything. It comes with so many combs, it comes with so many brushes, it comes with spray bottles, it comes with scissors, it comes with a curling iron, it comes with all kind of stuff and curlers and so many clips and all kind of stuff that you need. He says it's for free. Now, the tuition I'm paying is for my classes, so I guess it is free, but you know, nothing's ever free because you're paying for the college. But he said it's completely mine. They're not giving it to me for just the classes and then I have to leave it there. It's mine. I can take it home. I can keep the stuff forever and I only have to bring back to school the things that I'm going to need that day. So when I get this kit, it's going to be heaven. It is going to be heaven, heaven, heaven because I'm going to be getting so much wonderful stuff and I'm going to show you on YouTube what I get in my wonderful kit. I cannot wait for my kit. March 4th, I go for orientation. That's when I'm getting my scrubs. I don't ever have to worry about if I'm bloated and I have to pick an outfit for school. I already know what I'm going to wear every day for school. And it's going to be cute and professional. I'm going to even go in Walmart in my scrubs to just let people think I'm some professional medical person. But I'm really a cosmetology student. I don't know. I get so excited about these things. But I am so excited. You guys are going to see my kit. You are going to hear of all of my little tips and tricks that I'm learning. And I'm so inspired in the first place to go to cosmetology school because of Candy Johnson. And I love Candy Johnson. And if you guys don't know about Candy Johnson, you're crazy because you have to know about Candy Johnson. She is amazing. She just had a baby. She is the sweetest lady ever. Like, I had to just make this contribution to her because she went to cosmetology school and she is a famous makeup artist and she is so beautiful and she has four kids but she looks so young and I love her so much she is the sweetest you can just tell every word she says she is so sincere oh my gosh I just love her if she saw this video I would just die because she is so so sweet oh my gosh you can tell that she really does care about her subscribers and you can tell that she is a great great mom and she is healthy because she gets all this organic stuff she is just so great i love her and i cannot wait to start my cosmetology school and i'm finally following my dreams doing something that i like and i'm not even like scared about it like i'm not even afraid what if i don't make a lot of money because in nursing i constantly knew okay i'm gonna have money but every day i'm gonna be like ugh I have to go to work and it's crazy hours and you're always on call and so much stuff like I don't know but with this I'm gonna like going to work every day and I'm gonna love it and I cannot wait for the future actually I used to like dread the future but now I'm really excited for the future and I can't wait to start this school so you guys are definitely gonna be knowing everything about this school I just had to completely tell you everything because I am freaking excited to the max about going to this school. So, and now it's a little bit darker, so the lighting sucks a little bit more. But I just want to say that if you have completely watched this whole video, I love you. You are amazing because you have stuck through watching this video. And that means that I haven't completely bored you to death and you actually care about what I'm saying to you. But please, you guys, comment on my video. I have been getting some comments on my channel, which I love. I'm happy about those. I'm extremely happy about those. And they are so nice. I love nice comments. But I want you guys to comment on my videos because it's like I'm talking to you. And my one subscriber that I had got, Tina Marisol, Christina, she 
she subscribed to me and then she started commenting on my, all my videos and we would just talk a lot and now we have become like little friends and I know her and I wanted to be like that with a lot, most of all my subscribers that talk to me well I wanted to be like that with all my subscribers but I know that not all of them are going to talk to me so just comment on my stuff and talk to me because I want to get to know you so that we can know each other and also don't forget to comment and tell me which nail polish I should paint my nails. I know it's not like a big life decision that I need your advice on, but I just want to know what you guys think. So, please comment, please subscribe, because I love the support, I love the subscribers, and every time I get one, I just flip out and get so happy. Oh, I get so happy. But, I'm sorry for this long video, I just had to blabber about my exciting news, and now that you guys know, let me know what you think about that, if you're happy for me, excited, don't even care at all, whatever. And, I just want to say that nursing is not a bad job at all, it is not terrible, it is not dumb, stupid, anything. If you are a nurse, and you have a passion for it, and you love what you're doing, and you love helping people, it's a great job, it's an amazing job, and nurses are a really big part of the medical field, and they do help us, it's just not my thing, and I don't want you to think that I'm just bashing nurses, because I'm not, it's just not my thing, and I don't have a passion for it, and this is my thing, and I love it! Okay, so, that's enough, I'm gonna stop boring you, bye!